right, all right, my hip hop heads, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, we is in the music capital of the world, Harlem, US of A, ladies and gentlemen. We is on the hunt for those exclusive 50th anniversary hip hop metro cards. Trying to get my pink polo camera on action this week, but let me see how I did. Let me see how I did. All right, what I got? What I got? Oh no, ladies and gentlemen. Apparently, it looks like I struck out. Uh, guess I'm about a week late and two dollars and ninety cents short because the MTA decided to raise the damn fare. But that's an entirely different issue. All right, listen. I'm not going to waste too much time on this intro because all month long, and I really do appreciate y'all tuning in. We've been celebrating all the great hip hop fitted drops, celebrating 50 years of hip hop throughout the entire community. We've done Brooklyn, we've done Queens, and now we're up in here, Harlem, right in a little Staten Island. We started in the Bronx, and I feel like it's only fitting to end here. So, as a matter of fact, before I even get into that, did y'all check out last week? Look at this real quick. Look at this. We got us the Kid Cudi Man on the Moon Volume 2 Cleveland Guardians right here. But wait, but wait, don't forget about this beauty. Little Los Angeles Dodgers for you. Repping that Snoop Dogg at Dog Dogg at style from the good folks over at Fan Treasures, ladies and gentlemen. But this week, we're going back inside the studio and we're going to take us a little visit to Chi Town and talk about probably one of the most influential rappers of all time. So, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and all those who identify something in between, this week in Nerd Stuff proudly presents Fitted Friday's 50 Years of Hip Hop Celebration Part 4 with your boy, me, that cool guy, J.T. Little. Hit it. All right, all right, all right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, thank you for joining me back inside of the studio. We got ourselves all decked out here because this is quite the episode, ladies and gentlemen. First off, I just got to thank you all for tuning in this entire month to Fitted Fridays. I appreciate y'all so much. We've been celebrating 50 years of hip hop all month long. And you know what? We've seen some fantastic, fantastic hats. As a matter of fact, every single one of the fitteds that we've done so far this month are right up here, right up here on this top shelf. We got us, um, we got us some Dodgers. We got us some Pirates. We got us some some Giants. You know, representing you know the best of the best that we've seen so far. We got us some Mac Miller. We got us some Kid Cudi. We got us some Snoop Dogg. And you know what? These have all been great, great artists. But you know what? I found out about the hip hop community. Do you know what I found out about the fitted community? As much as y'all love making Mac Miller hats, there's one artist in particular that y'all really, really love making hats for. So, ladies and gentlemen, without much more further ado, we are going to take a fake trip over back over to south side of Chi-Town. And we are going to look at my boy, hold up, where that, my boy, and one of my personal favorite albums, Mr. Kanye West right here. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Breaking it out. Throwback. The CD and all. Look at this. Look at this. Oh, where that? Where that? Oh, the, it comes with the poster too. Woo. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at this. Yeah. That's tight. That's tight. Kanye West graduation. Oh my gosh, we're going to get to this. We're going to get to all of this in just a moment. As a matter of fact, as a matter of fact, I'm not even going to, I'm not even going to start off by like when the hat was released. We're going to just going to go in chronological order right here. So let's go and see what we can get ourselves into with our very first Kanye West unboxing here, ladies and gentlemen. All right. Oof. And, you know, there have been a couple of these fittings right here that I've been sitting on for quite a while. So let's take a trip down memory lane and see what we can find out of here. All right. So we're going to start over with our good friends over at Pro Image Sports. And the very first one that we got is, oh, my goodness. Look at this beauty right here. Some beautiful, beautiful Chicago Cubbies. Oh my gosh. It is so nice to actually have this in hand. This is looking fantastic. 
with the Wrigley Field side patch. Oh yes, 100 years, 1914 to 2014. Mm-hmm, good stuff, good stuff. We got us the flat batty with the brown, with the yellow, with the dark, with the tan. Yeah, that's the tan right there. We got us the yeah, we got us the gold new era logo right here. That's what's up. That's what's up. Red all around. Flip it on over. We got us the golden rod UV. We got us the black sweatband as it always should be. 100% polyester. And this hat is made in China, ladies and gentlemen. I hope that you are a fan of Chi Town because we are going to be seeing a lot of these cubby hats today. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. So first, let's 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 take it back right here. So this comes all the way and I mean all the way back to Pro Image and Fan Treasures uh Vinyl 3 collection. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That is a throwback right there. We got us the 94 to 99 6 Cub Bears logo right here. Look at that. Look at that. We of course we have us the 100 year anniversary of Wrigley Field side patch and it should go without any sort of like misinterpretation that this hat represents the very first of Kanye West's albums, the College Dropout. Um, funny enough, I, I, funny enough, it was a third of Kanye's album I actually listened through all the way through, and I, I don't need to tell y'all what the staples are right there. Listen, are you a Jesus Walks fan? Are you a All Falls Down fan? Let, leave it in the comments, man. Let me know what y'all feeling. Let me know what y'all feeling. Oh man, this one is gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Wrigley Field side patch, flat baddie, golden rod, tan, and brown representing the album artwork there. New era with the golden rod logo with the golden rod UV, black guts, 100% polyester, made in China. A banging way to start off our Kanye West tribute here, ladies and gentlemen. But, but, but. We, I'm going to let y'all know that we got a lot of fancy stuff going on here. We got us a lot of fancy stuff here because in addition to these hats, I got a whole bunch of like dope, dope, dope pin works from like various artists. So of course to go with our college dropout hat, we got to have ourselves our college dropout blip right here. Look at this. Look at this rice bowl college, college rice bowl we got us this Raheem Playlist College Rice Bowl Blip courtesy of Raheem Fitteds. If I'm mispronouncing it, my bad, my bad, my bad. You know, working working with what, what I got here. Oh yeah, we got us the full volume here. We got us the uh, we got us the college. We got us the college dropout. We got us the late registration, my beautiful dark twisted fantasy, and graduation here. Oh man, I can't you know what? You know what? Hold up. Let's 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 get a little up close and personal here, shall we? Ooh. Nice, nice. All right. Up, up, up. Yeah, there we go. Oh, this is how it looks. Oh, this is dope. Absolutely dope. Stick this bad boy on here real quick, and there we go. Look at that. Now that that works out quite well. That is gorgeous. Woo. I love it when a plan comes together. Oh yeah, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. College dropout to start our Kanye West tribute right here. All right, so let's move along here, ladies and gentlemen. Let's move along, because we got ourselves, we're not done, we are nowhere near close to being done. We're gonna take a trip up north over, over to our good friends over in Boston, over at Crown Legend, and see what Kanye West shenanigans they got for us, all right, all right? Yeah, here we go, here we go. Let's get through this real quick here. Oh yeah, there we go. Love getting through that unboxing sound. Isn't it great? Yes, sir. All right. Open this bad boy up right here. Oh, wait a minute. Let me just do a little showcase right there. Boop, boop. All right, now this one, I don't know how y'all gonna be feeling about this one, but let me tell you the story how I felt about this. When I first saw this drop right here, when I first saw this drop, I, I I immediately said to myself, hold up, hold up. This one looks like late registration. And sure enough, it does. Oh my gosh, look at this. Look at this. This is that Crown Legend late registration Chicago Cubs right here. Ooh, 
This is, oh my gosh, the stitching on this is gorgeous. Look at this 1990 Chicago Cub All-Star Game patch. Beautiful. Oh wow. So we got us the we got us the golden rod border. We got us the burnt orange and the light blue for our MLB Batterman logo right here. Did they go tonal? Yes, they did. Tonal new era logo here. Flip it on over. We got us the light blue UV with the black sweatband as it always should be. 100% polyester. And we got ourselves a hat made from China. Look at this, look at this, Chicago Cubbies, late registration, hat number two, let's talk about it. So first of all, I did a little investigation and I do believe that the actual hook of this hat was supposed to be for like the movie poster of the fifth element. And I'm just like, nah, this is, this is Kanye West. This is that, this is that late registration right here. I mean, come on, you tell me I'm wrong. Tell me I'm wrong. I'm, I'm, I'm not wrong. This is, this is gorgeous. This is gorgeous. All right. So we got us the classic 1979 to 1993 cap logo right here. The, like if this, if, if you could make fitted hats and could, and like make them into like a comparable state to like Pokemon car collecting, this is probably the most common logo to side patch combination out there. Like, I, like it, it's dropped like at least once a month that that's how that's how frequent this combo goes together and I don't blame them look at this it just goes together 90 side patch cubby logo beautiful 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 the flat batty with the orange with the burnt orange the golden rod and the light blue tonal new era orange button up here light UV here all right black guts as it always should be now, we got us the Kanye West late registration right here for you. I, I don't know how you be feeling, but I think, you know, of all the songs, and there's a bunch of them off this album, you know, Diamonds Are Forever remix, you know, Gold Digger, Hey Mama, Roses. I, for me personally, We Major is where it's at. We Major is where it is at. And I'm, and I'm not going to leave it dirty right there. Hold on one second. Hold on one second. Because, you know, we, we are doing the Kanye West thing real quick. And, of course, I got to throw in. I got to throw in this dope. This dope. Look at this. Look at this. This Kanye, this Kanye ghost pin here. Ooh. Hold up. Let's see if I can get it out of this plastic here. Up, oh, up. Oh. Up, up, almost. Oh, snap, crackling, pop. Look at that. Look at this. This is awesome. This is awesome. Hold up. Hold up. Now, ain't that fire? That is absolutely fire right there. We got us our Kanye Ghost Bear. This, this was actually a combo, a, a collab between a Fitted 209 and a Vintage Soul Company right here. Go check them out. Please, please do. They do awesome work, both of them. Like, oh, my gosh beautiful beautiful combo right here all right this is definitely coming together oh and before i forget see look the bear logo raised out too very very nice very very nice for our second of the kanye west drops right here all right now it is time for probably the most probably the most ingenious of the collection right here oh this one is one that i've been willing to talk about for a while and actually history is going to be made here ladies and gentlemen making their debut on the channel at this very moment is dpm fitteds ladies and gentlemen dpm fitteds making its way on the channel here look at y'all go all right here we go so before I'm going to talk I'm going to talk about this hook in uh, a little bit of detail but first I just need to show it off really really quick because I think I think there's a lot that goes into this one here. All right. Oh man, this looks like ooh, ooh, boy, empty empty. All right. So now whether or not y'all know this or not Kanye West it when Kanye West represents Southside Chicago, mentions it in numerous songs. And come to find out that as much as we all do love this bear logo for the Cubs, Southside is represented by those White Sox. So what they decided to do over at DPM Fitters was they decided to do a whole Kanye West hook featuring Chicago White Sox hats. 
right? And the one that caught my attention the most was this very dope graduation Chicago White Sox fitted right here. Oh my gosh, look at this thing. This thing is gorgeous. Look at the S with the O and the X. Oh my God, the Kaminsky Park 1917 World Series side patch. You rarely see this these days, man. it's awesome. We got us another flat baddie here. We got us the dark purple with the royal purple with the gold border. Tonal New Era logo right here. We got us the hot pink. We got us the hot pink over here. And then we flip it on over and I think we got ourselves, yes sir. We got us the little peach color right here. Peach color UV with the black sweat band as it always should be. 100% polyester. And this hat is made from Bangladesh. Look at, look at the, look, look. You can't tell me that, like, it, it just goes together. Absolutely outstanding. So, DPM fittings, right? Um, let me see if I remember correctly. So, actually, at one point, when I did get the hat, I believe they referred to themselves as Pro Image DPM, uh, which stands for, I believe, Danbury, Connecticut, uh, Poughkeepsie, New York, and Middletown. Middletown, yes, Middletown, New York, yes. That is the DPM right there. So he took me a minute, but we got it, we got it, with the Chicago White Sox. Now, I think uh, I think it was a four-pack. They had, um, what did they have? They had, they had graduation. They had 808 on Heartbreak. They did have My Beautiful Dark Twisted Fantasy, and I do believe they had the college dropout as their four pack for their collection here and i just and i just really love how they did the chicago white Sox here with the 1917 cap logo right here 1917 uh white Sox world series side patch from Sh from kominsky park and of course we got us the light purple we got us the royal purple and the gold mlb batterman logo tone and wear logo hot pink we got us a little peach color here, and we got us our black guts, 100% polyester, made in Bangladesh, fitted right here. Graduation, absolutely brilliant, a masterpiece of an album, probably, well, it's my personal favorite, but it's probably his best work. I mean, you can't go wrong with any of these joints, man. Can't go wrong with any of them. Stronger, beautiful dance track, I Wonder, Champion. And of course, probably the staple of the album. Well, I mean, there are a lot of staples of the album. Everything I Am, Big Brother, Homecoming. But let's not forget Flashing Lights. We all love Flashing Lights. Come on now, come on. And you know what? Because because we got ourselves our little graduation, a graduation hat has to have the graduation bear. Look at that, look at this. And this one is coming over from our good friends over at Pin Ship. Look at this. Hold up, wait a minute. See if I can get it out of this plastic here. Ooh, that's hot. That is hot. That is a hot bear logo right here. Hold up. I said it once and I'll say it again. This just go together. Look at this. Look at this. Kanye West graduation bear on our Kanye West Chicago White Sox graduation hat. Beautiful, beautiful combo right here. Yes, DPM fittings. Y'all outdid yourselves with this beauty right here very very nice hat indeed all right all right y'all just over the halfway point here ladies and gentlemen we've already seen what pro image we've already seen what crown legends and now we've just seen what dpm fitters have done for us and now let's see what the good folks over at hat club got for us oh my you know what's so funny this is actually the final piece of the puzzle here i had all the other uh, all the other hats just ready to go, but this was the one that I needed. I needed this one in order for this video to be a thing. And now, now that it is here, let us see what Hat Club has got for us. All right. Oh my gosh. Look at this. Oh, wow. We got a whole bunch of stuff here. All right. All right. Hold up. First, let's get to the hat. Let's get to the hat. All right. Let's get to this hat. Beauty of a hat right here. Oh my gosh, this is like deja vu. Didn't we just see this? We sure did. Once again, we got us the 1979 to 1993 Chicago Cubs cap logo. 
look at this side patch right here you know what this represents ladies and gentlemen a little 808 and heartbeat ooh 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 ooh, ooh. this looks so good hat club y'all out there look at look at this look at this you can't tell me that this don't look like the album oh my gosh oh my gosh all the colors with the stars beautiful flat batty with the red and the white mm -hmm. no explanation needed there tonal new era logo black button black visor flip it on over we got us the classic gray uv we got us the black sweatband as it always should be 100 percent polyester made in china ladies and gentlemen i give you the hat club 808s and heartbeat Woof, gorgeous absolutely gorgeous and you know i gotta say it was an album that took me quite a while um you know to get accustomed to because it was just so drastically different in almost every method of production than the other than the first three kanye west albums um i mean like yeah love lockdown was like it was good it was, it was different you know it, it took me a while to get used to it but then as i listened to the album more and more i just realized like man there's some damn good songs on here you know like amazing bad news paranoid but and but my personal favorite say you will i mean oh my gosh i can listen to the last three minutes of the song like it's it's just so hauntingly beautiful it's just gorgeous it's so good it's just so good it's so good it's such a good song and I, I know a whopping six plus minutes but hey hey it's worth it it's worth the listen of course we got this beautiful 1990 all-star game side patch are y'all sick of this one yet probably not <laughs> probably not once again we got us the flat batty red red and white we got us the tonal new era black button black visor gray uv black sweatband 100 percent polyester made in china ladies and gentlemen that is gorgeous gorgeous work right here but hold up hold up you what's what's crazy is when i looked into this box right there was like so many pins from hat club right here look at this look at this we got us the gold digger pin actually oh that's crazy that's that's wild right here we got us oh look at this oh look at this shine and glisten on this Th this is some hip-hop bling for you right here and we got us this these um these black stud pins right here but you know what's crazy you know you know what's the pin that i'm feeling that goes most appropriate with this we got to take it back over to pin ship right here real quick because they decided that you know what they decided that they was going to show a little love with boom the logo oh we got us the logo pin right here look at this look at this oh my gosh let me see if i can get it out of here oh yes that's gorgeous that is gorgeous hold up hold up oh wait let's see if i can get it in focus there for y'all look at this wait a minute wait a minute yep that just that just looks so good that looks so good we got us our heartbreak pin for our 808 heartbreak hat right here chicago cubs 1990 all-star game courtesy of hat club right here appreciate y'all so much for dropping this hat just a couple of weeks ago in their august uh in their august 2023 uh variety drops that they've been doing you know at least twice a week what it seems and i think that's very very dope they fit it for any collector right there all right i got a, well i see that i got one box left and i just feel like i have to say thank you all for continuing to watch you know please if you've made it this far i appreciate you all so much of course leave a like subscribe to the channel you know have those notifications turned on because this one is I, honestly i think this one might be the best of the lot it might just very well be and so we're going to take ourselves one last trip over to our good friends over at pro image sports in lehigh valley opened them up very so so many times before so you know i don't see why this wouldn't be any different let's see what awesomeness they have for us today in this box ladies and gentlemen all right here we go let's see what we got here oh man it's always good when they bag it up love that love that 
All right, so we got ourselves Pro Image Lehigh Valley. We got us, yes, yes. Look at this, ladies and gentlemen. This is the Chicago Cubs, 1979-1993. My beautiful dark twisted fantasy. Oh yes, gorgeous, gorgeous. Are you, are you sure you're not tired of this side patch yet? I'm not. Look at this, absolutely gorgeous. Look at this. Beautiful, beautiful. Hold, hold up, hold up. As, as a matter of fact, now that now that y'all seen the hat, I can, I can do this. I can do this. Where, where is it? At? I can show you why, why this just works. Look at this. All right. So I had to dust this off. You know, I had to find it because I knew it was like lying around somewhere. Got us the deluxe Kanye West, my beautiful dark twisted fantasy album cover right here. Uh, and you know what was so good about this? You know, you know, you know what was so good about this? Because they had the uh, where are they are. Yes, they had this. You could change out your cover art. You know, so they had the runaway. They had the original pixelated uh, artwork here. They have the power, the the, the cover for the power single. Uh, I do believe this one was Monster. I'm not too sure, and I, I have no idea what this one was. Uh, you know what? I'm just going to say that this one is uh, gorgeous. Because why not? Or maybe it's Devil in a New Dress. I don't know. I don't know. But what? in any event, look, where is it? I think... Um, yeah, you can, you can definitely... You can definitely see the work here. Look at that. Look at that look at that 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 is some very dope awesomeness right here my beautiful dark twisted fantasy these are some lengthy tracks by the way like you have no idea which one i want to use which one do i want to use yeah let's use this one why not i think that's the most appropriate one here stick it on in there yeah that's it that's the way how we go kanye west oh i forgot my sticker too got that um that our vintage soul sticker right here look at that you could go there too yeah all the kanye all right back to the hat look at this look at this gorgeous beauty right here um let's see. all right so how far into it did i get up here i think oh, oh another flat batty okay gold border i think it's a brown trim here and of course we got us the we got us the gold new era logo right here too red all around Green UV, because it makes sense. Black sweatband, as it always should be. 100% polyester, made in China. My beautiful dark twisted fantasy. A beautiful, beautiful hat. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Um, this album got so much hype, though, because it was basically, like, previewed that entire summer of, like, 2010. Like, because Kanye West, he, like, he did, he started the Good Friday the Good Friday free singles, you know, a uh, concept right there. So, like, there was, like, basically a lot of the Good Friday songs actually ended up making it onto the album. I was a little disappointed that a couple of them didn't. Like, I thought Lord, Lord, Lord and Take One for the Team are such great tracks. Like, oh, it's a shame that they didn't make the cut. But that's okay. You can listen to them anytime. I'm sure the links are still out there somewhere. Uh, let's see. Of course, we have us our 1990s Chicago All Star Game side patch, and I like that. I mean, what more can I say? It's such a dope hat. It, it really is. Like, I don't even know. Do I even have an appropriate pin for this one? Well, I don't know if I do or not. But I mean, I think the hat for itself is just fantastic. Look at this beauty. Look at this beauty. This comes from our good friends over at. Pro Image Bush Lehigh Valley, go check them out. Awesome work, and you know, I gotta say, th this this was so much fun. Like, oh, look at them all together, freaking awesome, man, freaking awesome. Look at this, look at this, so good. All right, so let's do a quick run through. Real. So of course we're gonna start off our, ourselves with the college dropout from Pro Image Sports right here. 1994 to 1996 logo, Wrigley Field side patch, and we got us our college dropout blip from Rohini Fitteds here. Very, very nice. Moving right along, we got us our late registration Chicago Cubbies right here from Crown Legend right here. 
we def have us the awesome um, Bear Ghost pin collab here from uh, Vintage Souls from the Vintage Soul Company and Fitted 209. Very, very nice right here. 1990 All-Star Game side patch to go along with that. What else we got here? We got us our graduation with the Chicago. We got us our group. We got us our graduation from DPM Fittage right here. Chicago White Sox represented with the 1917 Kominsky Park White Sox World Series side patch. We got us our Kanye West graduation bear pin from the good folks over at Pin Shop. From the good folks over at Pin Ship. Yes, 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 indeed. Beautiful, beautiful hat right here. Love how this one looks. Then we got us from our good friends over at Hat Club, the 808s and Heartbreak Chicago Cubs with the 1990 All-Star Game side patch, definitely represented by the album cover artwork right here. We got us the 1994... We got us the 1979 to 1993 cap logo here. And of course, we got us our pin ship 808 and heartbreak logo pin. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And last but not least, probably one of my personal favorites here. We got us the My Beautiful Dark Twisted Fantasy from Pro Image Sports Lehigh Valley. Same thing as the previous one, 1990 All-Star Game side patch, 1979 to 1993 cap logo. Ladies and gentlemen, wrapping up are in salute of Kanye West and basically his first five albums right here. Boom, boom, boom. Look at that. Hold up, see if I can get them. Yes, 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 yes. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Five awesome crowns here for your viewing entertainment. Oh man, this one was a lot of work, but it was so fun. You'll definitely be seeing a lot of tags on IG. And speaking of IG, why don't y'all follow it at This Week Nerd Stuff for all the daily posts, highlights, and pack openings that you will find there. Now, of course, we're going to have ourselves some more TCG YouTube shorts coming up. The best minute of pulls on YouTube, hopefully. We got us a brand new This Week in Nerd Stuff coming up on Wednesday. I think we're going to take it a little light this week, so tune into that. And of course, we're going to have a brand new Fitted Friday installment. We are definitely going to be continuing along with our 50 year celebration of hip hop fitteds uh, as the year continues. Uh, but I do have some other hats that I can't wait to start to show off to you. So I do hope that you continue to tune in. And I guess that's it, ladies and gentlemen. Until we meet again, please do cue that applause.